We are getting our first look tonight. The man police say opened fire inside a Dallas hospital, killing two hospital workers. This is 30 year old Nestor Hernandez. He is accused of shooting and killing two workers at Methodist Dallas Hospital in Oak Cliff on yesterday. Police have not identified those victims, however. Sources tell CBS 11 one victim was a nurse, the other a technician, both working in the labor and delivery areas of that hospital. Hernandez now facing capital murder charges. Police have not released a possible motive, but authorities confirm Hernandez is on parole, required to wear an ankle monitor, and was allowed to visit his girlfriend in the hospital yesterday in the labor and delivery unit. The hospital just announcing within the past half hour that it has increased police presence inside Dallas Methodist. We, of course, reached out to DFW Hospital Counsel Steve Love today about safety for you in hospitals. He tells us safety is a top priority, but violence in hospitals is on the rise across the nation. Love said, quote, some patients, patient families, and visitors have become very aggressive against hospital employees and the COVID-19 pandemic increased the incidence rate of workplace violence. He went on to say, quote, all hospitals want a very safe environment for patients and their visitors and still allow for loved ones to visit their family and friends in a very open environment. It is a delicate balance to be fair to patients and their families.